Hello everyone. Welcome to latest update program. The topic of discussion is India EU initiatives for marine pollution and green hydrogen. This topic relates to environment and ecology section of the UPSC CSE syllabus. Recently, India and the European Union EU have launched two major research initiatives under the India EU Trade and Technology Council. These initiatives are backed by a combined investment of 391 crore rupees, approximately 41 million euros. The initiative aims to develop innovative, sustainable solutions to tackle global environmental challenges. Before moving further, an important announcement: the offline batch of the IAS GS Foundation course, prelims plus mains, has started at Drishti IAS, Noida. Admissions are now open for both the English medium and Hindi medium batches. For more details, contact eight seven five zero one eight seven five zero one. Now let's discuss about two new initiatives. First is marine pollution research. The first project aims to address marine plastic litter and other pollutants such as microplastics, heavy metals, and organic compounds that threaten marine ecosystems. It is co-funded. by the EU and India's Ministry of Earth Sciences the initiative will develop tools to monitor assess and reduce the impact of these pollutants it aligns with global goals including the UN decade of ocean science for sustainable development and national policies such as India's national marine litter policy and the EU's zero pollution action plan and second is green hydrogen production from waste The second initiative focuses on the production of green hydrogen from biogenic waste. It is supported by the EU and India's Ministry of New and Renewable Energy. This project seeks to develop cost-effective and environmentally sustainable methods to convert agricultural, municipal, and industrial waste into hydrogen. It aligns with the EU's hydrogen strategy. and india's national green hydrogen mission now moving on to details about india eu trade and technology council ttc the formation of the ttc was announced by the indian prime minister and president of the european commission in 2022 it aims to create a high level coordination platform to tackle strategic challenges at the nexus of trade trusted technology and security The TTC consists of three working groups: WGs, WG on strategic technologies, digital governance, and digital connectivity; WG on green and clean energy technologies; WG on trade, investment, and resilient value chains. Now is the time for practice question: Which of the following statements regarding green hydrogen production from waste is correct? One. The initiative aims to develop sustainable methods to convert waste into hydrogen. 2. The project is part of the EU's hydrogen strategy and India's national green hydrogen mission. 3. It focuses on converting industrial waste into clean energy through solar power. Options A, 1 and 2 only. B, 2 and 3 only. C, 1, 2 and 3. D one only send the answer for this question in the comment section thanks for watching for more informative content like share and subscribe and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications